Thank you for watching my channel please subscribe and like. Now back to the news. He's hired. Sebastian Stan transformed into Donald Trump on set of the upcoming film, The Apprentice. In photos exclusively obtained by Page Six, the actor rocked the 45th president's wispy, sandy blonde hair while shooting in Toronto on Monday. The Marvel star was fitted in a black, single-breasted wool coat paired with a blue suit and paisley-striped tie underneath. In one of the scenes from the forthcoming movie, Stan munched on a sandwich while sitting on a park bench during a snowy day. Deadline reported last week that the actor, who has a history of portraying real-life people on screen, would be playing the role of Trump in the biopic. The Pam and Tommy star, 41, is set to act alongside Jeremy Strong as attorney Roy Cohn and Maria Bakalova as Donald's first wife, Ivana Trump. Per the outlet, the film is described as an exploration of power and ambition set in a world of corruption and deceit. It's a mentor protege story that charts the origins of an American dynasty, Deadline added. Filled with larger than life characters, it reveals the moral and human cost of a culture defined by winners and losers. The film will examine Donald's efforts to build his real estate business in New York City in the 1970s and 1980s. Of course, the title of the biopic notably references the businessman's stint on reality television beginning in the early 2000s. Donald, 77, previously hosted The Apprentice, which ran from 2004 to 2017. He also appeared on the show's spin-off, The Celebrity Apprentice, until 2015. He was let go by NBC in 2015 after making controversial remarks about immigrants during his 2016 presidential campaign. Production on the new flick comes as Donald is embroiled in a slew of legal battles concerning his time in the White House. The twice-impeached former president is also currently standing trial on a civil fraud case in New York City. Donald has not publicly commented on the forthcoming film and its release date has not yet been announced.